What's good? I love life crew. It's your boy Musa back with another reaction video. So I literally just finished watching Weak Hero Class um, season one, and I was like, wait, is there gonna be a season two? So I'm gonna check out this video. Um, yeah, season two is about to change everything. I'm intrigued. I'm intrigued. So run it, run it, run it. One has had a grip on. Wait, wrong headphones. My bad, guys. Switch it up. Let's go. Us ever since it came out, and we already want more. So mm. what's next in store for Yon Si Un? The popularity of season one showed in the number of viewers. We Hero Class One topped the drama charts and became a hot topic all across social media, surpassing the first responder starring Kim Dae Won okay. and Reborn Rich starring Song Joong Ki. It also became the most watched show on Wave, an online streaming platform that's behind the whole drama. Since okay. the first season was so binge worthy, people are already demanding more. From the attention gathered around We Hero Class 1, it's obvious that the second season would be a hit. So are the people behind the show planning the second season? That's the, the question I need to know. The production unit of We Hero Class 1 revealed in an interview that the second season is a huge possibility for them and that it is very likely that it's going to happen. You heard it here first, guys. The incredible show's continuation is in the cards and it's no surprise oh, as the K-drama industry has started to produce more seasons of the same dramas instead of the usual one season season type of thing. We truly weren't ready to say goodbye to the amazing show and to more importantly to Park Ji-hoon's portrayal of Yoon Si-un, a quiet intelligent student that uses his knowledge to fight against those mistreating him. His depiction of the main character was perfect, mm. showing another layer of his talents. The really praises good. of the show came also from the people who read the webtoon Weak Hero, I which is I what haven't. the show is based off of. One person said that as someone who is reading the manhwa, every scene in the show is giving them satisfaction with the fight scenes and casting being perfect. Park Ji-hoon is aware of people praising his performance and feels grateful for them. He mentioned in an interview, one of the comments said, in this series, I see shi Eun, not Park Ji-hoon, which was the first time I'd gotten such a compliment. That came as a very refreshing shock. It was something that I've been wanting to hear. It drives me to do better. The yeah. end of the last episode already gave us a hint that Yeon ji Eun's struggles are not over. Since he got transferred to a new school, we see him sit down in a new classroom when a new boy comes up to him and targets him, which results in Chi-un looking at him and curling his fist around his pen and, and gearing yeah. up for an attack. Also, in the end, we see a glimpse of a tattooed hand holding a photo of Yeon Chi-un at the new school and another voice asking, what should we do with him? Which means huh? that Chi-un not being truly away from the trouble. He wait, fought with wait, the wait, UFC I... candidate Kung Woo Young, so I didn't see that part. there's going to be some consequences to that. We also don't know what will happen to An Soo-ho once he wakes up and heals from his injuries. Mm -hmm. Well, at least we hope he wakes up. We Hero Class 1 deserves a second season it simply does. because of how raw it is and what message it shares, even if it's accompanied by some brutal scenes. Mm. The show spotlights the power of friendship among the outsiders and how they manage to get through when they can lean on each other and even what can happen when they fall apart. Mm. Even a member of the cast, Hong Kyung, who plays Oh Bom Sok, revealed hopes about more dark stories and worried with hopeful side like We Hero Class 1 will be made in the future. The mistreatment between high school students is nothing unusual to be depicted in television. However, We Hero Class 1 portrays it in very graphic scenes, which only deepens the emotions we feel for the characters. The masterful writing and portrayal of high school dynamics is something that many more people deserve to see, and his story deserves to be developed even further. The actor behind the role, Park Ji-hoon, really went all out when playing the role. He revealed during an interview, In the scene where I hit my cheek, I actually hit myself even during the script reading. That's how important of a scene I thought it was. Was. I thought that it was a scene that showed Si Un's spiteful image for the first time. He also added that the slap that he gave himself actually caused his cheek to be swollen the next day, so he had to ice it. Since the role of Si Un is centered a lot around loneliness, That's that crazy. was also something that Pak Ji Hoon had to get into. The actor revealed that the inspiration came from his life. I thought that the loneliness that Yon Si Un felt was similar to the lonely feeling I felt after my activities with 101 ended, and I went about doing everything on my own. In the end, Si Un is transferred to the new school, Suho is still in a coma, and Bom Sok was sent to study abroad by his influential father, so mm. Si Eun won't be a stranger to loneliness once again in the upcoming season. But it wasn't just Pak Ji Hoon's brilliant performance that left everyone speechless. Choi Hyun Wook was also amazing in the role of An Su Ho, Si Eun's friend with amazing fighting skills. The actor revealed how much work he put into making Su Ho's character come to life on screen. Apparently, he was known on set as the Idea Bank as he kept coming up with 
with how to improve Suho's character and the overall performance in each scene. Okay. Hyunwoo further explained that he put himself in Suho's shoes while preparing for the character and figured out what would make Suho more attractive or alive. The director praised him for his approach and loved his ideas, so Tae Hyunwoo was allowed to improvise some scenes. The winks between the fighting, the scene where Suho throws up a heart while looking at Siyun on the bus, and the scene where Suho teaches Siyun all the basics of fighting and later taps Siyun's cheek with his fist are all improvised by Hyunwook. He truly added a little more depth to Suho, nice. and we really hope that we get to see at least something of him in the second season. Please, the please. And the cast deserve all the praise for not shying away from anything and still managing to grab the full attention of the viewer rather than scare them away. And mm. season two might turn it up on the fight scenes. If the writers are going to follow the source material, the webtoon describes life at Undong High School, which is where Shi Un got transferred to at the end of season one. So who would come to reprise their role? Park Ji Hoon is definitely committing to the role of Yeon Si Un. His role as the quiet nerdy kid who uses his cleverness to fight bullies, stole the hearts of many, and he keeps saying how his role is a big turning point in his acting career. He confessed, I wasn't showing a cutesy image, but rather wanted to show a diverse and mature, but also bad sort of charm. Mm. Honestly, there are parts where I really wanted people to recognize my efforts, mm. and I'm thankful to those who like the drama. No, I didn't like it. Hand, I loved it. Big difference. Big difference. Is coming back to oh man, don't do that, that to us, man. You can't bring it back, but you can't bring it back. bad at the end of season one in the hospital. Oh, yeah, he was all fucked up. worried about his future. One fan of the show tweeted, If we Hero Class 1 has season two and Suho will never wake up again, y'all gonna witness the worst version of myself. Since the character of Bom Sok oh, is this also guy, out of the picture, we can't brother. be sure if Bong Kyung is coming back. Nah, I don't want him back, man. However, we would love to see the trio make a comeback. Nah, nah, I don't want him back, The actors mentioned that it took them quite a while to get close to each other, and therefore, the slight awkwardness that we see between Shi Eun, Suho, and Bom Sok is very much real. But the actors managed to become friends by the end of the show and even learn some acting chops from one another. Seeing them being real friends with each other on the screen, or even seeing them meet up for another project, would be a dream come true for every Week Hero Class 1 fan. Since the director of the show, Yu Su Min, hasn't commented on making the second season and only thanked everyone for the love the first season is getting, we can't be sure about season 2 yet. <laughs> He also says he was Yo. able to create a drama that inspires and at the same time raises awareness as to what goes down inside the institution that is not seen by the naked eye. Mm. Many fans of the show hope that the rave reviews, combined clips of the show going viral, and getting praised all over social media will persuade the director into making the second season. I the fans so. have a lot of faith in the renewal since there is source material still being made, meaning that the writers don't have to come up with future conflicts and plot lines from scratch. The Webtoon fans mostly love the show as well for its accurate translation onto the screen, so they would also tune in for season two. We still have to wait for the second season to be greenlit and for the official confirmation, either from the director or Wade. If we got the confirmation for the show somewhere in the first quarter of the next year, the filming could start in the latter half as long as none of the actors have scheduling issues. Mm. If we consider the filming and production going smoothly, we might be able to start seeing the second season of Week Hero Class 1 in the first half of 2024. Will you tune into Week Hero Class 1 Season 2? Of and course. what do you think will happen? Let us know in the comments. Thanks well, why, 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 for watching. Why wouldn't I tune it? Come on now. Of course I'm going to tune it. Season 1 was fire. Season 1 was fire. Um, Obviously, by the time you are watching this video, I haven't uploaded it on Patreon yet, but I will be over the next coming weeks. Um, Season 1. And hopefully we do get a season two. Um, it was amazing. Like I said, once I finished it, I was like, yo, um, I like the fact that everything was straight to the point. You know, like it wasn't, there was no pointless fillers. There was none of that. It was just direct, direct, boom, 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 boom. Um, which obviously kept you engaged the whole time, which I love. Um, those are my favorite type of dramas where it's just engaging all the time. And yeah, man, I was it was it's very good. Season one's very good. If you haven't seen it, definitely go watch it. I do highly recommend it. If you're looking for a K drama to watch, this is one you need <laughs> to see. Like you, it's a must do. It's a must. I haven't seen the web web compilation, which you called it. Um, maybe I'm after watch that. But then again, I don't want to spoil this. This is kind of tasty. And if we're gonna get season two, I don't want to watch season two. I already know what's gonna go down, so I might have to stay away from that one for now. For now. Um, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video if you did smash the thumbs up new to my channel subscribe and i'll catch you guys in the next one love life love life love life peace